what is up guys? My name is Ryan and I'm finally here for the combos version Alloy. As promised, I'm going to deliver the combos for Alloy. I know it's late, but I've just been busy, like I said. But better late than never, like I said, like I've always said. But anyway, starting with the combos for Alloy. So, for the skin. So, this skin was pretty good, better than I thought when it came to combo. That's quite a bit you can wear. Not just brown backlinks, but some white or grey backlinks go with the fur. Um, some tan backlinks, and of course the red and blue for the suit. Um, maybe some teal for the front of a shirt. So it's actually pretty cool to find combos with, and I wasn't that crazy about this skin when I first saw it, but it's grown on me more and more, and I really liked it when I was reviewing it. But now, the more I look at it, and the more I use it, the more I like it even more. Mima looks really good. It's a really good skin, actually. It's really cool. It might be one of the best Gaming legend skins we've ever gotten. I'm not lying. I love the detail in the skin. I love the aesthetic of her. I love the idea. I love the uh, the textures. I like the uh, clothing. I really like the fur, the arrows. I think I like the way it's sticking out. I think that's pretty interesting, but it doesn't actually look bad because you're not looking at it from that view. This backlink looks really good and some really cool combos actually. Better than I thought, so I'm very impressed with this skin. I think they did a great job at it. As I was doing the video, I wasn't totally crazy about the pickaxe, but the pickaxe too has actually grown me. It's actually a really good pickaxe. I really like the detail on it. Maybe yes, there are some times where I don't, but for the most part I do. All the styles for Agent Jones' back will look great. Um, I think the dirtier they get, the better they'll look, so I think the best will be the last two styles and the second style for her. Um, but no, it's a really cool skin. It's a lot of detail and... I think it's pretty accurate to the character alloy. I think it's pretty accurate. Um, Wild Heart Buckle looks great. Whisker Pack. So yeah, if we're going to keep getting more Gaming Legends skins like this, I'm excited to see what other skins we can get. The Gaming Legends series open up so many possibilities for some amazing skins from different video games, and I'm just excited to see more. Um, the uh, blue style of this will look really good. Yeah, you can get away with some futuristic backlinks, because obviously Horizon Zero Dawn set in the future. But I st still do prefer like the more like less futuristic or primal backlinks, but modern backlinks still work. Like this one looks great because the red and blue. Timekeeper. Um, orange looks okay, but I would go the blue version. Starcrest Shift. Seaworthy. If you're going to use the uh, other one, then you can use this one too because it's blue and red. Saltwater Satchel. And the Pokey Pack. Right, so the backlink. Blaze Canister. So I, when I was reviewing, when I first saw this, I did not like this backlink. And now... I'm still not the hugest fan of it, it's not really my type, but it was actually quite fun to find combos with. It goes with more than I thought, and it's fun trying to match up that green, especially considering that we don't have a lot of green, so I'll give it that. It looks good on my particular Maya. I might run this on my Maya, but yours will obviously be different. Singularity, the uh, tomato style or the pizza style. Um, some of these are like spot on, but others are close when it comes to the green. There's obviously all different kinds of green. It doesn't even go that well on her. I don't know the storyline with it because I haven't played Horizon Zero Dawn, but aesthetically, color-wise, it doesn't go real well. Lara Croft looks okay. Uh, Globe Shaker, but yeah, it's it's not a bad back bling. It's just not really my type. Looks great on her, though. Deep Sea Dominator. See, there's a lot of cool combos with this, so i got to give it credit for that. And it's always when it's a cool combo, Doom, Doom Jizz, question mark, question mark. Whenever it's a cool or interesting combo, even if it's a back bling that I don't necessarily am the hugest fan of, that always gravitates me to using them. Unless it's a back bling that's either just... Unless it's like a really boring back bling um, on a skin that has a better combo. But this, it's not a boring back bling. It's an interesting back bling. It's just not really my type. And I would say it's my least favorite part of the set. But still a very solid set. One of the largest sets we've ever gotten for a, uh, one, a set with one skin. Looks great on Barracuda. It's almost there, but I'd use that. Baba Yaga. Adeline looks great. So yeah, very impressive set, I must say. Very impressive. One of the, probably the best, if it's not the best Gaming Legend skins, because I know some people are mixed about the skin, it's definitely got to be the best set. Great pickaxe, great glider, a uh, very good wrap, and a great emotes, and a sick loading screen for anyone who cares. And the bundle is a very good deal. But anyway, it's pretty much going to wrap up the combos for Alloy. So if you guys enjoyed, let me know a like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think of this skin. How does it compare to other Gaming Legend skins? What do you think of the set? Do you love it? Do you hate it? Tell me what you think, and tell me what you thought of these combos. But until then, guys, I'll catch you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.